Oh, what's up guys, it's KJ48, welcome back to my 7 Days to Die single player let's play episode 83, that's right, Alpha 13, where are you, I do not know, um, should be coming out next weekend, we shall see, or this coming weekend, no next weekend, today's Sunday, so it'll be next weekend, uh, please, please I hope it comes out next weekend, alright, so we got some building to do, I have mined throughout the night, I've got a lot of iron. I've got more downstairs cooking. I got a lot of scrap iron. I actually had to make baked potatoes because my food situation is becoming quite dire. Um, we are going to go ahead. Actually, before I forget, let's stop this now. I don't want to cook all my potatoes because what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to between this and next video at some point I am going to do some hunting and I'm going to try and find some deer. So yeah. Uh, let's see. I think we got everything to head back to the Hub City. So let's go on there. We're going to stay at the Hub City overnight. I'm making two videos back to back right now. Um, so we will be staying there overnight. So let's just, uh, come on down here. It always makes me nervous jumping down this freaking ladder. I don't like doing it. <laughs> and, uh, this is all the iron I've got. I've got some more cooking up. See? No problem. We're good. Uh, maybe if we're going to stay there two nights, let's take some of this as well. Um... I want to make sure I have plenty of scrap iron to upgrade the spikes. Yeah, that's yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Um, any iron that's cooking now, we won't have tomorrow anyway because we're not coming back here. So it makes total sense to just you know, let's just uh, put what we can here uh, for 25 minutes, and that should be pretty good. We'll take this iron and turn it into scrap. Well, we shouldn't because it's going to make another stack. None that it really matters. All right, let's get going. Enough dilly dallying. I'll show you where I've been mining out, man. It's crazy. Alright. I keep the, uh... I, I'm getting sick of driving through here, so I just keep the... I keep the bike parked over there. Alright, so I've been just mining like crazy up here. Just, just going nuts. There's iron everywhere. It's really nice. Um, so... Oh boy, look at this. Mining up here too, just, you know. Plus, I don't think I get the bike through there very easily anymore. So... Go ahead and get up here. Alright, back up a little bit. I wish they'd let you open the door from the bike. That would be nice. That would be very, very sweet change. And this is my single player game, so I can leave the door open as much as I want. You got that, Pam? Haha. -ha. I like them apples. Alright, let's go back to this. Uh... So anyway, I did another Alpha 13 update video, the second one. You guys seem to really love them. I'm probably going to do at least one more. Um possibly two, uh, talking about update stuff, uh, but the thing is I pretty much talked about most of the things they're, they're adding in the game, there's a couple things I didn't touch on, uh, but the thing is, you guys in the comments are just going, going nuts, I think my last video had like 122 comments, last I checked, and they're all really good comments, so I think, uh, we'll do at least one more update video for Alpha 13 and, uh, hopefully, you know, that'll be the last I'm thinking maybe Tuesday or Wednesday, um, actually Wednesday would probably be a good time Oh, someone's calling. I have to take this. I'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. Alright. Let's see. We can go through here. Go. Yeah, we always go up this mountain right here. Yeah, jumping everything. That was awesome. Here we go. Watch out. Coming through. So anyway, uh, Mad Mole did a video uh, about Alpha 13, and it wasn't like... Uh, so much of an update video it was more of a uh, he was just playing the game he played the game for like 40 minutes and it was awesome it really really for, it gave me a lot of good ideas on how to survive you know like change my play style a little bit um you know because the game's going to be harder in some some ways easier in other ways and uh trying not to do everything so so much on the first in the first week of the game like my problem playing this game is i'm always trying to do everything right right away like if i don't get like a if i don't get a base built like in the first couple days like, I start freaking out, and it's, it's really bad for me. Um, so, but the, the way he was playing, he kind of just like, you know, take it, take it easy. Just take your time, you know, it's not not a huge hurry. And uh, just build up when you can, you know, and stuff like that. It's, it's pretty, I really enjoyed the way he played. Um, damn it. Alright, we're going to go this way. So it really helped me out um, watching that video. Plus, it was a great video showing like the skill system. The skill system was the main thing I, I got from the video. It was really cool. Um, the way the skill systems work. Really, really sweet. Um, I'm really excited for... Uh, it's going to be a whole new game. It's going to be a whole new game, man. Like, Yeah, it might have taken a long time 
for this alpha, but man, it's good. It's like, it's a new game, basically. Just a better game. Really, you're on top of my wall, you fucking bitch. So, oh, damn it with the cursing. All right, that's it. Last curse this video. I promise you. I probably shouldn't promise that, but... <laughs> yeah, I'm really trying not to curse too much. You know, there's certain video series I do, like The Forest, that are really gruesome and, and adult-oriented games, where I curse and I don't really worry too much about cursing. Although, even even those, I don't want to be cursing constantly, because that's just tacky, you know? Um, but for this series, you know... Although, I guess this could be considered an adult game as well, but... I try not to curse too much in this series, and I'm going to try really hard not to. Yeah, this stuff hasn't even dried yet. Damn it. See, that's what happens, because uh, I wasn't in the area. I need some room here. Um, why did I bring freaking coal with me? Why did I bring a cooking pot to bring that up? Alright. So we need to get a lot of wood ready. And here we go. Really? Try and stay undetected here. Man, I keep shooting over their heads. I think I'm assuming that the, the bolt is going to fall, you know? Yeah, I'm never going to hit that guy. Whatever. Let's try this again. Yeah, you see how this guy, like, bobs his head up and down and is really hard to kill? That's gonna be the way every zombie's gonna be from now on. I think I'm already screwed. Yeah, I'm screwed. They're already starting to spawn. Why can't I hit anything with this? Yeah, so it's still the bolt still pulls to the right, but it, it doesn't pull up. Oh, whatever. See, this is what happens when I haven't been in combat in this game for over a week, and this is what happens. I'm gonna try not to use my health kit with that uh, bleeding effect. Forget it, I gotta use it. Yep, stuff spawning. Forget it. Forget this sneaking crap. I'm going in. Alright, so this is gonna be two out, so we're looking at one, two. Spike, spike, open, open, wall. Jumping on the spikes, you dumbass. You know, you're not chasing me out anymore. Whoa! Stupid holes. You know, I should start bringing, like, regular bandages. I hate wasting a first aid kit just on a bleeding effect. Alright, so what we're going to do is, we're going to chase this out with this. We have no room for anything. Yeah, this isn't going to work. We need to, What we need to do is we need to get back into our base and drop some stuff off uh, upstairs. So that's what we're going to do. I don't know how I'm going to get in there easily. Alright, I know we can get in there easily. Switch this out with this. Like so. And we're gonna get- oh, the cop- yeah, this is a no-go. We gotta get out of here. 
I'm gonna go upstairs, drop everything out, and then we're gonna go hunting. Change of plans. Okay, use this to get up here. And then use this to get up here. That right there. Nope. Right there. Pick these up. And we're good. Alright, let's get inside. Go upstairs, drop some stuff off. And then we'll get going. We'll just go do some hunting. Because this is this whole place is when that when this uh when this area gets this riled up, you might as well just leave. There's no point in being here. Alright, so there, there, there. Um, you can go up there. Got you, 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 you. Just drop everything off, screw it. That's good. Let's go. Let's go do some hunting. Okay. All right. Let's go get the uh, let's go get the bike and do some hunting. Drop this off. Yeah, I don't know exactly what I did wrong there. I guess what I did wrong is I missed with the crossbow. I guess that was what I did wrong. I'm not sure. Maybe the maybe the hornets called in the horde. I don't know. It didn't seem like the hornets called in the horde. It seemed like when the zombies saw me and started walking to me, they basically just, you know, called in everything. So, yeah. Alright, bike. There you are. Where should we go? Let's go over this way. Whatever, zombies. You lose. Again, you always lose. So, get used to it. Oh, you should be used to it, because you always lose. You might have prevented me from doing some building, but I'm just going to go get some food. Come back, you won't be here. Yay, wellness! Thanks for infecting me, jackasses. Alright. Maybe we should hunt not on the bike. Maybe that's alerting the deer before I'm close? I don't think so. But I guess it's possible. No, I've seen deer next to me before. I mean, it might make them run, but I'll, I'll be able to see them usually. I really don't want to walk. Uh, I'm seeing nothing. Just zombies. Oh, there we go. See, I told you they don't run. Now, we don't want to smell, especially when we go in the hub city. So we will keep all of the smelly stuff on the mini bike. <clears throat> Ooh, what's that? A house. Oh! Look at that. This is, uh... Uh, what do you call it? Um, military camp. But the problem about military camps, you gotta be careful because they have mines everywhere. And sometimes you can't even see them. I'm really kind of nervous about this, actually. Yeah, okay, so I see one of them. But some of them are, like, kind of buried. See, that was kind of buried. Now these jackasses will set them off. See, there was one right there. Alright then. Alright, now this right here is all about loot, so we will loot every body. Ooh, that was a- damn, that was a good drop.
I'll leave you melee, you fatty. Uh, actually, you know what? I think almost every time I've been hit today. Jesus. Yeah, that was rough. They barely even hurt me, but that's because I had uh I had health coming in from the health kit. I just want you guys to know this is not max spawn. This is normal spawn. <laughs> Pretty crazy. Lots of loot though. Thing is, I haven't used the crossbow in a long time, so I'm not that good with it anymore. Just like anything else, you gotta practice. Actually, you know what? We should take this. Any of that. My goodness, never ends. Damn zombie apocalypse. This is what I wanted, right? Punk ass. Ooh, bear. Careful here. Uh, okay. Good. Thanks, man. Much appreciated. Now, where's my bike? You know, we should find the bike and mark it with a red arrow, a red flag. Oh, here we go. Where is he? Where's that bear? Is that him? That's a rock. No, that's a bear. That's a dead bear. Apparently the bears are going to be zombie bears, too. In the uh, update. Well, I don't know if they're all going to be zombie bears, but I know there's going to be zombie bears. Alright, just to clear up my inventory, let's eat some stuff here. Put this away. We've got nothing stinky on us. Let's put other crap away that I don't care about. Let's make some bandages. That should be under healing. Simple bandage. Now we're not going to be wasting this crap anymore. If we get bleeding, you know. I've wasted way too many health kits. Like, if they just hit you and they barely do any damage and you start bleeding, man, that is a big waste of a health kit. You know what else we need? Goldenrod. Let's remember to grab some of that. Alright, where did we come in? I believe it was right here. Okay. Alright, let's loot this place up. There used to be really awesome loot in here. Not so much anymore. By the way, you could pick up these sandbags. I don't bother though, because they're not very strong. Oh, we're full. Okay. Uh, blue denim jeans? What, what, what am I wearing? Black. They're all purple, so who cares? Break this up. Wow, look at that. A lot of good loot now. Like, it's, you know, it's kind of funny. It's always, like, the way it works, right? You know, when you don't need the loot, it all comes in. Not that I don't need it. I just don't need it as much. Mm. Should I take food? I probably should take canned food. I'm gonna break this stuff up too. By the way, hunting knives after the new update is gonna be the only way you can get. Um, well, hunting knives or bone shivs are gonna be the only way you can get leather. You have to use these on the animals. So they're gonna go from completely useless to one of the best items you can find early game. It's so like the fun pimps. They're always like one way or the other, you know? Like 
they'll have stuff that goes from useless to like the best item in the game you know or go from the best item in the game completely overpowered to useless you know it's so funny all right scrap and let's make some more simple bandages there we go we can throw a couple out we don't need that many all right let's get back to the let's get back to the uh, hub scene we can do some building before nighttime i never put the flag down on my thing did i unbelievable I know it was over here, though. Can I walk through here, man? Ooh, do you get sand for these? I'm just curious. See, you should be able to get sand for these, right? Why can't you take sand out of the sandbags? For those who've not who've not found it, not for those of us who have not found a desert biome. Where's my? I think this is the wrong area. I'm a little nervous about this. Yep, there's one. There we go. All right, spotted is a little bit farther out over here. Okay, so back to the hub city. We don't want to drive right through. We'll drive over here and just park right there. You don't drive through the hub city because as you're driving through, you're spawning zombies. That's exactly what you don't want to do. You want to go in the hub city quietly. Okay, up the hill. And stop. I usually like to stop until I see it. There we go. What the fuck is a dog doing all the way out here? Damn it. Again with the cursing. God. Seriously, what is wrong with me? Like, that's a real problem. Okay. As long as I bring it up to myself and remind myself to stop doing it, I'll eventually stop. It just, it'll take a little bit. A little, it's called conditioning. And it'll take a little bit, for sure. Let's go this way. Yeah, they're all over the place. I can hear them. They didn't even leave. Doesn't even feel like they left. <laughs> I thought they would have despawned. I was gone for a while. Hmm. All right, well. So we, we still have never brought our shovel, have we? Am I ever going to remember my shovel? Stupid. Okay. Quiet. Try and be quiet. Oops, didn't want to fall. Right there, right there, there, there. If we can make this too high, we can start working on it whether they see us or not. And the higher we get up, the less chance they're gonna have of seeing us. Remember we were all the way up top, they could like they couldn't really see us. We should make more rebar. Nah, let's not do it now. Now is not the time. pretty much all of them we got some guys over here so let's uh let's go loud now oh oh i put all my wood away cage cage you're really starting to piss me off now really starting to piss me off with your freaking ignorant not paying attention Ugh, that really that really kills me the freaking wood We'll do what we can. Alright, let's put this right here. No, that'll work. Alright, let's go. Come on. 
Oh god, this is making me- this is giving me motion sickness. I'm not gonna be talking too much here, because I'm trying to concentrate. Because this is making me very nervous. You guys, if you ever come to the hub city and you get chased out, it's very frustrating. Like, I know I get frustrated too with it, but just leave and come back. Try and be quiet. If you can't do it, leave and come back. Go do something else. Go, you know, farm something. That's why the hub city should never be your main base. Like, at least not, not to start. You know what? We might be able to do a little bit more here. No, we don't have the we don't have the stuff with us now. Let's just go. It's been a long video anyway, so. All right, let's pick this stuff up. Okay. All right, that was pretty good, guys. Now we just gotta hope that they we got a really spawning idiot. Why are you spawning up here? That, that bothers me. There's a couple things you could do for spawns. Although technically, you know, technically, um, these, these things do not do anything for spawns. Um, apparently, putting down a sleeping bag is supposed to keep stuff from spawning within a 15 by 15 block radius. It has not worked in a long time. I don't know if they fixed it yet or not, but that, that never used to work, just saying. Um, it worked for like maybe an alpha, but then it broke and I don't know if it's been fixed. So, putting down a sleeping bag might help with spawns. And another thing that people say is putting up lights help with spawns. Like, they, they won't spawn if you have light up. Now, that's a Minecraft thing. I don't think that that works in this game. It's never been said that it works. The Fun Pimps have never said that that worked. But it does seem to help. Like, if I put up lights... If, if, if I get this place completely surrounded in a wall, and I put up lights and put down a sleeping bag, even though technically these things are not guaranteed, I think they will work. They've worked in the past for me. So, those are two things that we can do, and we will probably do it pretty soon. So anyway, that's going to be it for episode 83. We'll see you next time for episode 84. Till then, take it easy.